Welcome. So what I want to do is I want to uh, help you determine is 75.2 and 61.6 and 9.4 and 7.4, do, do they form a proportion? And what I mean when I'm asking do they form a proportion, can we set both of these fractions equal to each other? Now, just initially looking at it, you say, well, they're not exactly the same. But remember, um, fractions don't have to be exactly the same to be equivalent. For example, if I had 1 half equal to 2 fourths. Well, if you're going to look at something, if you have 1 half of something, that's the exact same as having 2 fourths of something. So it, all it is is that denominator is just saying how much more you're breaking apart. So we need to determine, even though I've broken this up differently, is 75.2 of 61.6 .6 the exact same as 9.4 and 7.7? .7? Now, there's a couple ways you could do this. You could simplify and try to reduce one of the fractions, the larger one, to see if it can reduce down to your uh, fr uh, fraction over here. Or also, you can just determine, does my numerator and denominator, will it evenly divide into this? And I look at this and I say, all right, well, 9, forget about the decimals for a second. If I multiply by 9, to get to 75, it's going to have to closely be 8, because 9 times 8 is 72, um, and 9 times 9 is 81. So I want to see, would 9.8, would that evenly divide? And now, without a calculator, you could easily just take 75.2 and divide it by 9.4. But I don't have a calculator. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to estimate and say, well, what if I take 9.4 and multiply it by 8? Is that going to give me somewhere close? Or actually, it will give me somewhere close to 75.2. Or if not, if I multiply 7.7 .7 by that same value, will I get up to the 61? So when I multiply here. I get um, 32. And so I end up noticing that when I multiply by 8, I get 75.2. So then I'll check 7.7. 56, and that's 61.6. So when I multiply, notice when I multiply, I get 61.6. So therefore, this fraction can be reduced down to 9.4, therefore stating that these two fractions are equivalent and therefore form a proportion. Thanks.